Thanks, Louise. It's the largest wildfire in California this year. More than 14,000 acres have already burned due to the rapid spread of what's being called the Coral Fire. Thousands of people east of San Francisco are under evacuation warnings. Ben Tracy is in Northern California for us in the city of Tracy. One structure on the ground. The Corral Fire ignited in San Joaquin County Saturday afternoon. By Sunday, it had exploded to 14,000 acres and counting. The cause is under investigation. Fire crews are out battling uh, this, this fire in, in very tall, dried grass. Cal Fire Battalion Chief Josh Silvera said dry conditions and high winds are fueling the blaze. As more than 400 personnel work to contain it, two firefighters were injured over the weekend and are expected to recover. It was fanned very, very quickly. Um, you know, the fire was growing faster than we could post updates. Time-lapse footage shows when the fire began Saturday, as billowing clouds of smoke rapidly grew in size. Later, an airplane passenger flying into San Francisco captured this footage of the spreading flames from above. There's a fire on 580. The conditions also led to the temporary closure of two highways that have since reopened. Thousands of people were asked to evacuate as the fire left swaths of scorched earth in its wake, with some properties leveled and others narrowly spared. Everything was getting lit on fire. It was, it was intense. Kern Gill took this video of the fire closing in on his home. He said he and a neighbor stayed behind to fight the flames off, even pulling water from a swimming pool. We took just anything we had that could pail water, buckets, uh, cans, whatever we could find. I feel like if I wasn't here, it would just everything would have burned down. Now, the fire started near the Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory. They do research there on nuclear weapons and climate tech. We're told the flames did not reach the lab and that there is no damage. Ben Tracy, CBS News in Tracy, California.